Well, some good news now about a local business that's just gone global. Gotham Records has just opened an office in Los Angeles. The label represents 40 bands from the Birmingham area. They've benefited from a recent drive by the government to increase exports of goods and services, as Callum Watkinson reports. David Cameron's been in India promoting British business on a trip bursting with crafted photo opportunities. Whatever the spin, the substance is that to be a player in the 21st century, Britain needs to be selling abroad. Barry Tomes has got the message loud and clear. After 40 years finding, managing and promoting bands in the Midlands, he's just opened an office a little further from home. I think this is a, definitely a highlight in my life because I've opened an office in California. I'm a kid from a council estate in Birmingham and I've opened an office in California. Living the dream. So too are the 40 local bands on his Gotham label who now have representation in a music market that's notoriously difficult to crack. Super 6 will launch their debut album in LA in August and follow it up with a US tour. We're like uh, every rock and roll band that's ever been. We're, we're, we're good at writing songs and good at playing shows, but we, we haven't got a clue about promoting ourselves, really. Uh, we'd be like headless chickens, so uh, having someone like Barry who can kind of galvanise us and point us in the right direction, really, um, it makes all the difference. But Barry had a little help on the West Coast from the same government agency that sent the PM East this week. UK trade and investment may not sound very rock and roll, but they knew how to strike the right note in the Sunshine State. I wanted to meet music supervisors. <coughs> Excuse me, it takes about, I don't know, a year to meet 100. They got 230 music supervisors in Capital A Studios in Los Angeles over four days. Through a party at the British Consulate in LA, 400 music industry people came. I think I can find an export market for just about any company that's working in, in this region. There is something out there for them. They need to come and have a chat with us. We'll find that market for them. We'll help them align themselves to get in that market and we'll get them out there to meet the people so that they can actually go and do the deals. One of the people Barry met was Jimmy Lloyd, whose show, Songwriter Showcase, is America's best known shop window for emerging musical talent. He took the chance to give him a crash course in Midlands musical heritage. He said to me, um, isn't somebody from Birmingham? I said, well, yeah. He said, Ozzy Osbourne. Then I reel off, you know, Ozzy Osbourne, Led Zeppelin, Slade, UB40, thousands of names. And he goes, wow, I don't believe you. So we sort of did a bit of Googling and he says, I just don't believe it. And I said, and the business is still great, still thriving, still new bands. Please come to England and make a TV show. Two months later, they did. The half-hour show about six up-and-coming Birmingham bands will be shown on NBC later this year. The government thinks that to fix our economy, we need to double our exports. Barry is just one example of the strings they'll pull to help, whatever you're selling. Callum Watkinson, ITV News.